The next stop is on the radar radio. Stand clear of the closing doors, please. Yeah. Yes, sir, baby, on the Radar Radio. Yo, special guest in the building. Hey, My bro. guy Kaz is in the building. What's up, bro? How you feel? I feel great. Which name are you? So we going by Kaz today. Yo, bro, I ain't going to hold you. I got a lot of names, man. That I got a lot name, of I got bro. a lot of names, bro. Why but got so today, many names? Yo, all right, so I never really explained this before. Okay. All right, so, yo, everybody in the town know me for Chris Casanova. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I've been a legend in that name. Um... I went to a label, you feel me? And it was supposed to be like everything was like sewn up. This is you probably know these people, like really good guys. They might be my friends. They might be your friends, you <laughs> know what I'm saying? So we having a conversation and everybody's like, yo, we know Chris Casanova. Yeah, yo, this is easy. Let's make it work. Played a couple of records or whatever the case might be. And yo, <laughs> niggas went over to Spotify, right? Mm -hmm. And was like, yo, you ain't got a million streams on one of these records. I don't know if we could help you if you got a, this dominant feature on your, on this project, mm -hmm. and you ain't got a million streams. And I was like, Is it the? Let me. Can I guess which? I'll let you is? guess. SZA? How'd you know? Just <laughs> word up. Cause so, I feel like that was like. I mean, you have like. I wrote down some other people you did yeah, stuff with, like yeah, yeah. Smoke Dizza, yeah, of and course, Family, Dolly, yep. and so on and so forth. Family Five, Five Zombies, Family too. Yeah. But like, I figured that it was probably SZA. Yeah. I mean, if we look at it, like the biggest name that you have, that's on record it. That's with, it. Yeah, that's SZA, a lot yeah. of people that don't have. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. I say that to say, yo. So I felt like my name was just being comfortable with people. Like it was kind of like, yo, it was like cousin, cousin Chris. Like it wasn't a threat when you hear it. You feel yeah. what I'm saying? So I was like, all right, yo, cool. Let's shorten it. Let's go by Cass. And I'm gonna get everything that I could, and that's Chris Casanova. Mm. And it worked. I like that. Yo, bro, it fucking worked. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So depends on who acts, you know what I'm saying? In Miami, they call me, you know, Cam. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, over here, you know, like I, I just got a lot, man. I'm an icon, bro. I'm gonna do the Jay Z, Jigga, Sean Carter, S. Dot, Hove, you know. So Chris, yeah. Chris Casanova, Christopher, depending on who, who asks, who yeah. acts, you know what I'm saying. But today I'm Cass. Word up. Well, cause I, here's what I was gonna say is like, cause like when John broke Chris Casanova in the thing, yeah. Like I had heard of you, and then I looked you up, and then I was like, wait a second, he, he hasn't, hasn't dropped, dropped the project in, yeah, for, for sure. Yeah, I'm like, nah, hell hold yeah. on, and I called John. I'm like, John, this don't seem right. I'm like, am I looking up the right guy? <laughs> He's like, no, 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 you gotta look up Cass. Yeah. Yeah, now that's like, a fact. Oh. The crazy thing is the numbers up there is running up now too, which is amazing. You yeah. feel me? But you know, I switched the name. Um, a lot of people that uh, was rocking with me from back then, they just starting to catch on to like, okay, Chris. Chris is, Casanova. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah, for sure. Is it we? Is there no way to migrate the old projects to Cas? So I was thinking I feel of, like there has to be a way to do that, right? Yeah, I was thinking about that too. Like I'm still like in the in the process of is that actually what I want to do or do I kind of just want to let that live like as that, you know what I'm saying? Like is I mean it's still you. It's still me, for sure. I mean, I haven't thought about it too much. Like I've been so focused on just trying to create who Cas is gotcha. that I haven't been like, yo, we got to make sure that everybody knows you know what I'm saying? Like, about Chris, right. got like the project with Scissor Flap with Zombies right, and all right. these other Absolutely. incredible people on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, but that's definitely something that I'm, you know, I'm, I'm considering though for sure. But if I migrated, it wouldn't be Chris Casanova. It would be Cass featuring Scissor Flap with Zombies, and I'm trying to figure out if that's something that I actually want to do. You feel I think me? you should. Possible. It's bro. part of your history. It's not it like is. you changed all that much oh, yeah. from Chris nah, Casanova absolutely. to Cass. It's in my DNA. I mean, I'm a Gemini, bro. So I am technically. Oh you God! Know, come on, bro. <laughs> but um, you got flip floppy. A lot. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah I can I see know. it. Oh, yeah. I know. I know. Yeah. <laughs> right, John. We got, we got we got a favorite Gemini too, right, come John? On. <laughs> come on, man. For sure. But yeah, man. Like I, I feel like I haven't in the, I haven't really like jumped out and tried to like explain it. I kind of just switched the name and just kept it rolling. You feel me? But mm. you know, slowly but surely, I'm getting people like around and be like, "Oh, I know this guy." From being so, uh, cast, absolutely, not Chris Cast, no, exactly. but like realizing that it's the same person. It's the same person. You know what I'm saying? So, which is definitely the hardest part to make people realize that it's the same person. Especially now, because I mean, the attention span of people, as far as like in music, is is not like how it once was, where everybody's like invested in. Uh, like the story, at least right. in my opinion, you know what I'm saying? Like, unless you in some type of scandal, people aren't like, oh, I'm trying to figure out what exactly happened. It's not like mm. the blog era where it's like, yo, you will find out every detail, detail. about a person's life. Now, it's a, you on a, you on a playlist, you better, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. 
it's kind of I like your song. I don't know who you are, but I love your song. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So there's that though. You over sure. at 300 for a little bit too, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, yo, my guy. Um, yeah. Uh, I did like a couple of projects with them. There's actually another project that's coming out. I don't want to state what exactly it is, but come to think of it, I just did like another performance for them. That's for like something they got cooking. Yeah. Um, man. Uh, my man Kelly is over there, Kelly G. Oh, excuse me. I feel like he was there for a second. Now he's like kind of like consulting, but my man Nolan is over there. Um, but yeah, like they always like tap in with me, you know what I'm saying? Just to like put me on whatever project that they necessarily got happening. Uh, linked up with Kevin, Kevin Lowes mm -hmm. um, as well. Like that was, that was dope too. So yeah, it's love. So right now your partnership is with SoundCloud though. Yeah, uh, I'm sorry, bro. So three, you, was you talking about like 300 as if though, like I was signing to them? Is that where you was going with that? Yeah. Nah, like this you was just, just performances. With yeah, them. Okay. And, I mean, and even that, like it's like a lot of conversations, but not necessarily like something that I'm like, yo, I'm trying to get down with like 300, like you mm. know what I'm saying? But they definitely got like a lot of dope things. Um, my distro, I got two separate distros. I got one through SoundCloud, and then I got one through Empire as well. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, so I kind of like do back and forth whatever I kind of like like whatever you want to do or this time around exactly do you work with Bobby at Empire yeah Bobby's my man bro. shout out Bobby man <laughs> Bobby Fisher yeah, Oracle nah, that's my a brother good, that's a good guy man Bobby's for the sure. one yo really is bro like super solid great guy um yo I, speaking of good guys yo, rest in peace to whole thing rest in peace to my it's brother whole thing but I say that to say um in the same kind of like like group in the sense of uh, very genuine, right? At least the relationships that I have with Bobby, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying. So I say that to say, like, I put them in the same kind of group, you know? Right. People like Hovain and Bobby are are very rare yeah. in this industry. I mean, cause um, yo, nobody's really trying to give out information. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of times, like people are trying to like hoarder uh, information, cause you know, like that's the power, right? Um, but Bobby as well as like Hov have been like very um, yo, helpful. Like both, like if you ask them a certain question, put you in the right direction. Um, and I feel like that's not common. Like I've been here for a minute, bro. And I, like people are very stingy. Like they'll tell you one thing just to kind of like throw you off or discourage you. Or, yeah, facts. But like, I mean, I want to like solely like, like Bobby's great, but like solely like with Hov, yo bro, like, he would give you like a whole play. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, this is who you speak to. This is what you do. This is how this works. Um, you know, but um, so I'm going back and forth between the two. I don't even mean to like intertwine them or whatever the case might be. Right. But we, we talking energies. You know what I'm saying? Let's do that. Yeah, yeah, we talking energies. For sure. Yeah, they for got sure. Because the I don't want to make it like and that. And same, but, very like similar good intentions. That's where I'm going with that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And that's kind of like the world that I like live in, bro. Like I've been in this for for a good minute and my name is good my relationships are good mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying nobody got nothing bad to say at least not to my face <laughs> it's never to your face yeah right that's good <laughs> yeah as long as it is right you know, you know so but yeah for sure shout out to bobby man shout out to bobby right, rest in uh, peace our good brother whole thing, man. we miss absolutely. you bro we miss sure. you we miss you for um sure. so so you changed the name all that so i want to ask about the scissor record because that was 24 14 or 2013? Uh, I want to say it probably was like in the middle of both of them. Like okay. probably like in the 13 going into 14, I believe. You want to know what's crazy? My boy Matt Cody. I don't know if you know Matt Absolutely. Cody. Yeah. My brother. Yeah. Oh, Matt that's Cody. fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like we was around each other not too long ago. Like at a at a, a BMI songwriter's situation. Camp thing, yeah. Camp thing, you know. Yeah. But he was yeah, one of the Matt first Cody. producers I interviewed on this show back fire. in the day. Like I, went, I pulled up on him in his studio. We did like a little in studio um interview but that's why i wanted to ask because i wasn't sure if maybe one i didn't know if y'all two knew each other matt cody yeah yeah and i didn't know if he might have also helped connect the dots for that record because you know if you know it's more of a if you know you know but yeah, matt yeah, cody no, played a big part in early days of scissor recording in her basement absolutely and stuff like that. i mean i say this too like uh yo we're friends me and scissor like that's the homie for mm -hmm. sure a lot of love um i don't want to make this where it's like yo scissor 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 mm -hmm. but i say this though uh Man, let's see how this goes. But I say that to say, once upon a time, <laughs> let's see how this goes. nah, cause I'm and I'm glad I didn't smoke. But like, yo, once upon a time, like I was supposed to be on TDE. Like they came to New York to actually like, yo, vibe out, do some records. I had an A and R that was with me all the time. Mm. Um, but at this time, this might be a conversation that's us. But at this time, <laughs> I say that uh, at this time, me and SZA was always already friends because mm. she used to come to my shows. 
Um, I known her. Um, I know, I don't know if they're still together right now, but I know somebody that she was like that they were seriously in a relationship with, mm -hmm. uh, who used to work over at a clothing company at Ten Deep. Gotcha. And they used to like yo send bags of clothes, like all kinds of shit. But she used to pull up to the to shows and just like watch me get busy. One day sent me over a record. Um, record was phenomenal. Just on some like yo, let me hear what you think. This is before she really like started like ripping, like really going or whatever. Yeah. Um. At the time, my manager was really cool with. Her uh, soon to be manager. I feel like we was in that kind of stage. Okay, you know what I'm saying. Um, I say all that to say, I got that. I got the record just because of a friendship. Mm. <laughs> like she came with me to the studio, and I was, and I sung. Like I'm underneath the hook. I'm, yeah. I'm and I'm just going, yo, you want, you want to do the hook? And she was like, yeah, fuck with it. You know what I'm saying? Like it was kind of like it's not as difficult as people like make it out to be. Yeah, because it sounds it like it's gonna be like, yo, what did you have to do? Yeah. It was really on some like. Yo, genuine energy, genuine love, speaking to Matt Cody because he was with World's Fair and shit like that. Yep, yep. And all of that is for, uh, they were on 24K as well. Mm. Um, I want to say, like, if it wasn't that same session, it probably was, like, the next session. Like, she, she was with me one, and then they were with me the next. If not, we were all together. Gotcha. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, so definitely... Um, Matt was Matt is the homie, but that it wasn't Matt. <laughs> yeah, because Matt used to just be with her recording in the basement in Jersey. He yeah, used to tell me, so I wasn't sure if there yeah. was a connection there. Nah, right absolutely. No, nah, absolutely. But it wasn't it wasn't that. That's that fire. Sure. Yep. So what have you been working on lately? You got a couple EPs out now. Yeah, man. I'll just I'll just pull it up because I wanted to make sure I said it absolutely. correct. Absolutely. Cause bro, when you put the names in All to, yeah, I know. I know. I know. Cas rules everything. Yeah, Cas rules sure. everything, you yep. know what I'm saying? Yep. You yep. and quality. Yeah. Um, you got a few other projects that you dropped too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Which no, I'm glad that like I saw that. Cause like when I looked at your old page. Yeah, you're like, what the what's going on? And I was like, oh wait, he got that shit. He got the <laughs> yeah. shit with Connie and shit. Yo, I'm not gonna hold you, bro. Uh last two years I've been the most consistent. Right. Like I've been like really like grinding and really like hustling. Um as you can see, like you scroll, yo, it's just like all twenty twenty two. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like I will say uh, yo, bro, since March, I feel like I dropped every month as far as like a record. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm good for that. Like, I figured out what works for me. And I think that it's um, just being consistent and people just kind of like seeing me move around. So, last project, me and Quality, that's family. I'm not sure if you're super familiar. I'm not, but I, but I got bro, a little familiar with your project. I'm not going to hold you. I, I'm not saying that just because obviously we're working together, mm -hmm. but one of the most talented, uh, one of the like low key, you know what I'm saying? Like, but definitely like a vicious animal, bro. You know what mm. I'm saying? As far as production and as far as like, yo, putting those words together. <clears throat> like I'm a fan of like wit. Like I, I call it like slick talk. Like I like when somebody say some real slick fly shit. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like you wouldn't expect. I hate when I could see like the punch coming. I hate when I can necessarily like telegraph like the line. Mm. Um, yo, Q is a beast, bro. So he's somebody that's like, yo, he, I kind of like still sh sharp and still. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Iron sharpens like iron. iron. All of that, bro. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Sharp and sharpen. <laughs> but um, yeah, me and him put together castles, everything. Um, we have records like from years ago. Mm. I'm not sure if you heard of Biggie Capo. Did you hear that song? Mm, I'll oh, you heard Biggie Capo though, right? Mm. Yeah, the um, reason why I say that, that's kind of like what really like started our like... Your relationship together. Yeah, Fire. like I mean we we had one obviously like a little bit previously, but this that was the one that was like, oh no, we got some. You know what I'm saying? So this has been a project that people have been looking for for a while from from us, mm -hmm. you know? So, um, but yeah, before that was No Favors, before that, uh, long story short, mm -hmm. um, all within, I feel like two years, bro. You know what I'm saying? And then I just got like... Records that I just been releasing, like Michael, that's been doing like crazy. I kind of like, bro, ain't no rules no more. Like you can kind of like do what you want the way that All you want to. All the time you want, yeah. Bro, I got records that I'm gonna come clean. I went to LA a few times. I've been writing for people, um, and I'm I'll create a record. Yo, y'all fuck with it. You think somebody gonna pick it up? And they be like, yo, we still thinking about it. If they move too slow, I'm just dropping it. You know what I'm saying? Right. I, um, so I got different sounds of things. Got records with Eric Bellinger this go. That's, That's been super fine. tough. Yep, yep, yeah, yep. bro. Um, I got one with my man JC. Uh, JC is super tough. We working on a project as well. Uh, R&B dude. Um, my man Mike Classic. I'm not sure if you're familiar. I know with Mike Classic. Yeah. Mike is tough. Bro. Mike is tough. Look at look. He's really excited about that. <laughs> Wait, you from Queens? What? You from Queens? No, he's from the Bronx. He oh, just I like, got you. He yeah. just fuck with him. Yeah. Nah, Mike is one of them guys too, bro. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, um, but yeah, just been consistent. You know what I'm saying? Like just trying to make sure. 
Um, I'm giving out quality music. I'm giving out like and being consistent, bro. For sure, for sure, for sure. That's fire. So what's next? We got more projects on the way in 2023. Yeah, bro. I mean, um, man, I at this go, I just wanted to. Like I wanted to get back on people on the radar. <laughs> you want to get back on people's radar. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like that was necessarily like my goal for like the like the last two years was just like stirring it up, like letting people know like you know really what's going on. Um, pandemic kind of slowed up a lot of things, obviously. Mm. Not able to do shows and shit like that for a little bit. Um, but yeah, like yo, next the next goal, I'm trying to throw my own festival. I'm working on that. That'd be tough. Yeah, bro. I'm really good with like a lot of artists. Like they fuck with me, and I'm not just saying like from just. The art, like we all people first, you know what I'm saying? So I got like a really good rapport. It's important for me to um, help people and put them in position too, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like making sure I could do more in that space. Definitely more, the, the least that people are looking for me from, like looking for me is music. I'm gonna just drop. <laughs> right. I got, I'm dropping in January. I'm dropping two records in January. Mm -hmm. Like I'm already, you know what I'm saying? I got a, probably a project that's coming out in March. Um, but like I said, small projects, I'm not giving nobody 26 records, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I'm just trying to make it where it's as consistent as possible and, you know, doing what I necessarily need to do. Did sure. you ever live in Buffalo? No, nah, I got family there. Why you ask that? Because when you say art, you say it like they do. Do I? Yeah. Yo, I've been told that I like, took like I'm from a lot of places, bro. Down south. Last place that they think I'm from is Brooklyn. Because a lot, yeah. Cause, no, no. Well, you sound like you're from Brooklyn, but <laughs> the way that they say art, they say, they emphasize the RT. Oh, you really? So it's like, it's art? like the art. <laughs> art. And the way that you said it, I'm like, yeah, he, said, he, said like he sounds like don't watch TV. <laughs> <laughs> like he sounds like, he sounds like TV. And like, because it don't be like, they don't really have like, Buffalo people don't really have like a lot of like things in their. I guess their accent that really kind of make me be like, oh, that's a Buffalo accent. Right, right. But, but like that's when they, it. <laughs> when they like roll up, when they roll their R's, like yeah. when they or when they say, you know, R, something with R, like art, art, car, car. Like I, <laughs> I love in the car. Like it's like a mix between like the New York and Boston accent. Right. right? It's like the perfect in between. Like we're not. <laughs> I'm not Buffalo. from. Not like Boston. Right. right? right. Or uh, Boston. It's like somewhere in the middle where they're like. Car, like car with the extended R. Yeah, no, that's Shout out Buffalo, man. Come on, I love man. you. I got the mayor. I got the mayor of Buffalo in the building, so I'm good. We yeah, good. there we go. We sit there you. we go. No, that's tough. Yeah, no, nah, everybody thinks I'm from everywhere. I mean, it is it is Brooklyn. No, nah, they think I'm from Harlem. That's I crazy. Think, I, I, you don't really give Harlem. I don't. Name. I don't think so either. I get a lot of love there. Shout out to Harlem. Shout but out to Harlem. I'm from the town, man, for sure. Brooklyn, for sure, for sure. Well, hey. look, man, I appreciate you being here with me today. Yo, Thank bro, you for killing that freestyle. I appreciate you, man. I feel like I did it in one take. Yeah, that's something to brag about, bro. I had to say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. <laughs> you did one take. That's yeah, the, come on, man. Come on. Uh, not up. a lot of people can one take shit. You yeah, feel me? Yeah, no, absolutely. Um, we but we got a couple records dropping in January. Yes, yes. So um, be on the lookout for that. Definitely, definitely some more shows uh, happening in the first place. Um, we're going to be around, bro. I think they can't really get rid of me. <laughs> doesn't matter how many times you change your Yo, damn name. Yo, it don't matter. Watch the next go, man. Christoph is the next name. <laughs> is the next name. A million I'm streams. I'm not co-signing that. <laughs> I like Kaz. I like Kaz. Word up. Nah, I appreciate it, man. For sure, for sure. Well, Word I appreciate up. you, bro. Yeah, thank Before you, Before we get out of here, though, let the people know where they can follow you. Anything yeah. else you want to let the fans know? Yeah. Now's the time to do it. This camera right here. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Yo, on IG, I'm Cast Rules Everything. Uh, on Twitter, I'm Chris Casanova, Christian Mingle, I'm Christopher, nah, I'm, I'm chilling. Um, check out the, <laughs> check out all my projects on, 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 all DSPs, we everywhere, man, capital K, capital A, capital S, man, make sure y'all tap in. Um, man, I'm dropping every month, if you miss one, you're gonna pick it up the next go, you feel me? For sure. I appreciate you, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Absolutely. This was smooth. Well, make sure you go follow him. Go yeah. run up that freestyle out yeah. now. Let's uh, do it. Go run up those EPs out now. Go run up those singles out now. Absolutely. More heat on the way. More shows on the way. Let's do it. Uh, more name changes on the way. Let's do it. Till next time, <laughs> Kaz. Absolutely. Go, oh, wait. That's a, that say do the show some support. Show, go show <laughs> some love. Love is free. Support is free. But y'all already knew that. Till next time, Come Kaz on. on the radar. Brooklyn, Buffalo. There we go. Um, yeah. Somewhere right. else, wherever he might be from. We out. <laughs> Word up. My appreciate God, you. Nah. Big love. Bro, you know I appreciate that.